It's COVID over? COVID's over, I think. Oh Season my gosh. COVID's over. Psych! At the beginning of the pandemic, I thought I had set everything up for myself in the Bay. <laughs> like I had my home, I had my garden, chickens, fruit trees. It was great. I was alone. <laughs> I was constantly going from LA to the Bay just to access my relationships. But I think COVID really cemented my need to ground and root back to what I consider home. So I'm moving back to Southern California, at least for a couple months, just to kind of enjoy it. Today's my last day in LA and feeling sad about it. I was feeling just anxious from being here in Oakland. I needed to change my environment. When I was in LA, I was staying in this beautiful place by Griffith Park where it was very quiet and in the morning all I would hear was birds. Oakland's going through a major gun crisis. I grew up here when it was very violent and I have very traumatic memories from it and I just I'm just like you know what I just don't want to I don't want to hear gunshots every other day. I love the home I've created but I can't change the environment around me yeah. and home is such an important place especially COVID showed us that is ultimately our safest place. And it's time for me to start thinking about where I'm gonna build my home. Yeah, I think I'm realizing too that home, a lot of it is people. Yeah. And like being in proximity of the people who nurture you the most. And I feel like we did such a great job at being in reciprocity with each other. We need to do a little bit of um, weeding. weeding here. Yeah. COVID opened up this new feeling because I think in our heads, we can always understand what home is, mm -hmm. but I feel like it opened up this new feeling for me to like really feel what it feels like to have another voice in your space, to, like music playing, that sense of peace and to just be able to put your shoulders down. Well, coming out of quarantine, and I've been doing a lot of things now that we don't have to wear masks all the time. So I've been on, can you get out of here? <laughs> You're watching me record. Yeah, I'm gonna turn off the TV because I don't like it. I was afforded the privilege at the beginning of COVID to be able to grow my own food, to be able to harvest from trees, um, and to be in like mutual aid with you and with other friends. And I just wonder how many folks like me who are queer, trans, uh, POC, don't have access to that. Um, so I also started a nonprofit in the middle of COVID to get Black, Indigenous, and people of color back to land. Boo, my garden is like popping. I feel like, I feel like this is a reflection of like my mental state. It's like the soil is fertile. <laughs> Look at this. I mean, what? We don't know where COVID is going. It's so pretty. And we know that our capitalist economic system is just completely trying to rush towards going back to the pace it was at, even though most of the world is not yet vaccinated. We don't know what the future of these variants are. We don't know what's gonna happen next in our state. I mean, we're experiencing on this part of the world, record breaking heat waves, just a state up. We are going to have to rapidly figure out how to support each other and our creatures and our plants and our ecosystems because we just can't do this alone anymore. Being in a germ pod with you and really going deep into our friendship. This one I started from seed. Really has been a model for how I want to have other friendships. I think I am excited to keep building with people who are just like you, just willing to jump in when needed and at the same time who are willing to slow down to properly assess and to like tap in with intuition. I'm ready to continue being in a germ pod with you, whatever comes next, because in reality, germ pods are our future. Mutual aid is our future. And I feel like I pick you. Yes! So pick me back. I pick you back, boo! So we're a germ pod for we're a germ life. Pod. Yes. Should we get a tattoo? I think we should. Your first tattoo, my 20th <laughs> tattoo. <laughs>